Assalamualaikum and a very good evening to my uh, classmates, to my lecturer, Sila. And today I will be teaching you all about uh, and uh, sorry, I will be teaching you all that touch typing is a necessary necessary skill, or is it? So uh, I have a leading question that is how how often you type, uh, how fast do you type, and this is uh, usually the question that. Uh, the interviewers will uh, ask you when you apply for a job and the term touch typing itself is like actually unknown to a lot of people like uh, a normal people but whereas uh, when you work in law when you will work in as like translator better you need a skill so today what i'm going to teach you guys is uh, i'm going to teach you what really is touch typing by definition the benefits of touch typing and how can you start practicing so uh i have another question how often do you uh how often do you look at a keyboard while typing and if it's often you then you have uh, probably have a very hard time to adjust adjust for this technique but if you're not so often uh, if you do not so often look at the keyboard then i have good news you have you are like one third of the way there so, I have definition from Tikopedia 2015. Touch typing is a method or skill of typing without the use of sense of sight or simply by feeling the keyboard by touch. Uh, going deeper, so touch typing is a technique that requires your finger, that is our fingers, to memorize the location of the keys on the keyboard. So, uh, so they uh, there is no visual aid while uh, typing you are solely de depending on your fingers at uh, uh, muscle memory is what they say so this trend or this skill a uh, birth when qwerty was a thing uh, on directors of the uh, yesteryears and the function of the qwerty system is to like group all the alphabets in the english language to be as far wide as possible and and that is to maximize the both of your both of your hands to accelerate typing process. And now the QWERTY layout is on every keyboard. Uh, as you can see, your laptop, your phone, and this is a, a very very good basis for if you were starting up in English language. As as English student, we 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 type in English. So we have. Uh, and Nixon elaborated that once you master the correct techniques, you learn it right with time that you're perfecting it without trying. At that point, it becomes second nature because your fingers memorize the position of the keys rather than your brain. So, now, so clearly, I want to like I want to get you, uh, you guys to get interested in touch typing. But, uh, how, what are the benefits? Yeah, what are the benefits? So. We the very obvious one of uh, acquiring touch typing skill is speed. So to put this in like uh, uh, perspective, I imagine you're typing an essay. So this essay usually takes one hour for you uh, to type with your normal typing speed. You usually hand it back. You look at the keyboard, but with touch typing, if you learn how to touch type, you half the time. So uh, uh so uh, example, if you take one hour, it will now take. 30 minutes to uh, type the same uh, passage so the second uh, benefit less fatigue and more work this is more like to your neck because you're constantly looking down at the keyboard uh, keyboard with your eyes and without that you focus more on the hands and more uh, uh, to the screen to the output of your text the third ma the third one is more uh, career option so as, uh, uh, as I mentioned Earlier in the speech, a lot of job based on writing letters, document require a fast type speed. Uh, you or uh, you you need a fast type speed to keep up the pace of the company. Probably you you need you are a stenographer, interpreter, translator, so. uh, and the other one is for to avoid RSI. This is for the, for your health. So repetitive strain injury again uh, about your neck is when you flex your muscle the same muscle repeatedly so you look down you up look down look up and that will create rsi and then next so we have shishola no did said uh, said that touch typing skill frees up your cognitive energy that uh, meaning uh, your working memory is easier easier working memory uh, that and uh, then also means more efficient uh, so you focus more on the output 
and rather than the keys on your keyboard and it is easier to retain and process information you you uh, because looking at the keyboards is like a distraction all this like that okay so no now we know the benefits so you might you want to know where do i start where how can i start so uh, online if you still learn about if you uh, look about touch typing there's a there's a lot of there's a lot of techniques uh, there's a lot of like uh, sources that you tell you which finger goes where which finger goes where ASDL, JKL, all that stuff my my perspective is that uh, find your uh, comfort zone first what this means is uh, you type the words that the usual english words you don't know as an exercise but before that it takes a lot of it takes a lot of ongoing practice and perseverance is key so you have to keep it keep it doing keep doing it do not ever stop because it, it, it is an ongoing practice so in online for online practice you have uh, for example 10 fast fingers uh, is it, it is a website that gives you word challenges and give you random words and you have to complete them in the box under one minute uh, that's for fast fingers and for type racer it, it is a multiplayer platform where you race with real people and 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 you rate uh, and you with type racer uh, what differs that from fast fast fingers is that you type passage instead pay passage instead of uh uh, uh jumbled words and these steps help you find your comfort spot for your hand because because uh, the position of your hand, the comfort position of your hand doesn't always land on the home row which is the ASDF JKL. It probably uh, uh, up where there or a lot a bit lower. And and the third one and, and another one uh, actually this is a little bit outstretched. You can get a blank keyboard. It is exactly what you expect. It is, a, it is a keyboard without letters. You don't have any letters on it. So, Ivanova said, "When you beginner, you, know, you, you are sorry. When you are beginner, touch typing looks clumsy and counterproductive. But believe me, this isn't so. The long-term benefits of acquiring these skills are worth the effort. Don't get discouraged quickly and don't give up simply because being really rough. You don't need a lot of practice. You do need a lot of practice. But once you get lack of touch typing, you wonder how you manage to live without it. So." To, to to conclude this uh, speech, I explain to you what is touch typing. We basically typing with looking. The benefits are speed, efficiency, and uh, more jobs uh, will offer you. And this, uh, it takes again. It takes a lot of practice. Emphasis on the lot. And online type and online typing games. And now you can get the keyboard and start making the keys. And that's the end of my speech. Thank you for listening and have a good day.